Okay, well, um, we're back, and uh, I've downloaded the uh, the app onto the iPad. Um, there were several ones um, I could uh, download. I downloaded them all. Obviously, because I'm recording on the iPhone, I'll uh, I'll also download them on here as well. Um, there's a couple other um, ones that uh, were not for the iPad one because it hasn't got a camera on it or video. So uh, I'll download these purely for the uh, iPhone 4. Um, right. Okay, just a couple of things. Um, firstly, obviously it's got an American um, charger. So uh, I've got this. Um, actually very good. I got it from the Gadget Show um, uh, a couple of years back. Um, it's a UniPro uh, multiple adapter. Um, obviously I've taken this apart because I'm... Uh, Charging the cable there um, in part of it, um, but yes, yeah, this is really good. And uh, take this on holiday. It's also got a couple of USB um, ones on the top, and uh, it pretty does every country I've ever been to. Um, really handy, and uh, wasn't very expensive. So yes, uh, recommend one of these if um, you're going to get a Swero. And um, uh, yeah, we well, yeah, I use this all the time. So this is what I'm using at this moment because obviously it's a US uh, adapter on this particular plug. Okay, so basically, as you say, I've uh, put it, connected it, connected it to the little charger there. And I think I'd, uh, I've already done this once. Um, I'll just show you uh, what you end up having to do with it. Um, so here we are, you get the, uh, the 3.0 with the, uh, the heavy end is the one that's actually which has got that on it. I would expect it to be the other side, to be totally honest, and have the uh, that on top, because I think that's quite a cool little character. Um, but no, it's the heavy um, uh, end has to go onto the uh, the charger. So let's just drop it into here. And see that little blue light on the bottom there to say that it uh, it's charging. Now obviously, this is the first charge. Um, on it, and uh, let's see what happens here. Might actually say because I think it's actually charged up, fully charged. So that might be so telling me that first time I dropped it in there, it sort of lit lit up. Oh, okay. Well, anyway, it's not gonna not gonna do it this time, or is it? No. Okay. Well, basically, you shake it a couple of times. Off it goes. Well, there we go. Look. All different colours, which is good. So pop it down there. Um, while I'm about it, I'll I'll, I'll uh, just tell you about the little um, quick start guide that I got. We obviously uh, showed you this a little earlier. I thought it was really good. Basically, what I've just demonstrated there it goes over the uh, is I was learnt from these steps. So it wasn't me really just. Um, Doing it all, it's basically what they told you to do. So there you are, plug it in, heavy side down, drop it in. So it's after five seconds, uh, remove the serial lights up. Well, obviously, it didn't do that until I took it up and shook it, but uh, perhaps that's because it's charged up now, already out of the box, which is good. Uh, Ciro is uh, is always asleep coming out of the charger. We found that, so we gave it a, a double sort of um, shake there. And it says, uh, Sphero blinks three unique colours until paired. Well, it's already paired because I just did it with my iPad. After you paired Sphero, uh, Sphero will reconnect automatically. And obviously, you know, it's coloured to say that it is actually paired. And then Bluetooth setup, I've already all done, done that as well. It says launch apps, which obviously downloaded before the end of this demo. Um, this is quite interesting, it says uh, flashing red means it's time to charge um, again drop it into there and it's mentioning three you see on there three hours um, to charge so that's good, Compl complete when solid blue light so I don't know what that flashing was, perhaps it, said it was already charged, I don't know um, but that's the situation, so that's all the, 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 um, the bits for the iPhone part and if you turn over Hey ho, it's got the Android um, device and it goes over the same bits and pieces 
fact that I enjoyed and what to do to set it up. So I thought that was quite cool, little, uh, really. Being a bloke, that's all you really need to know um, about it, because obviously we like to play around with these things and uh, not read a uh, manual, so I'll shove that over there. Okay, good. Right, well, I'll just have to uh, um, put this down again. So I pick up my iPad and we'll go over, see if we can get this thing uh, up and running. Right, here we are. Got my iPad. Oh, that's my Ronald Stein concert uh, thing, so let me just... No, you're not going to see this, so I'll just turn away for a second. Right, OK. We're all locked. unlocked now. Right. As you see, I've I, uh, downloaded all of them. Um, and I made it into the entertainment box. I wondered whether it's, it would say, because they're all Sphero, um, whether it would say Sphero sort of uh, there, but it hasn't. It's just uh, class it as entertainment, but that's fair enough. So, um, there we go. That's the ones that I've downloaded. Sphero, Draw and Drive, um, Sphero Drive, and Sphero Golf. There is another couple of uh, ones, but because I've only got an iPad one, obviously it hasn't done that, so... Now this is the first time I actually have loaded it up, so uh, let's turn it around to the other thing. Um, oh, what does it say? A firmware update for Zero was available. Can he download it now? Oh well, okay. <laughs> let's do this. <laughs> I might be back in two seconds. Oh, it's got a little nice little bit of music. Well, I won't bore you with this. I'll I'll come back when the up uh, when the update has come back, so we can actually get this thing uh, up and running. Okay, I'll leave you with the end. A little bit of music. Oh my God, it's elevator music. Right. Well, I'm sure you don't want to be here listening to that while we're waiting. So I shall come back in a minute. Okay. Well, I'm back. Um... I sort of kind of got rid of the uh, the update for the moment because it sort of uh, took a long, long while and I wanted to get playing on this thing. So sort of, um, might be update a little bit later. I um, thought I'd show you this. This is quite interesting. It's kind of some of its uh, little setup. Um, obviously, I haven't started this up before. This is the first time I've actually played with it. So it says um, on here, place two fingers on those, those white dots. A couple of screens before that was... Uh, doing a few other things as well but I thought I'll take it up from here so here we are and uh, on there it shows a blue light can't really see it on here can you see that blue light yeah and basically I turn it towards me so it's facing me All right there we are that's facing me and now it's uh, asking to test so uh, I'll press the test button. There we go. And uh, it said, "Did Sphero go straight ahead?" Yes, he did. Remember, you can aim Sphero any time. Got it. Yes, I have. Right, let's go and re retrieve him back. Okay. Um, so, where are we? Let's look at a few of these things. Well, I'm pressing, but nothing is happening. Hmm. Okay, all right, well, perhaps we'll come out of that. And we'll go for something else. Zero drive. Just 
those you need to put on the floor, which I've done. Next, there's a tail light. See the blue light. Oh, this is kind of what it was doing with the last one. Yes, I can see it's going round and round. Place two fingers on those white dots. Oh, here we go again. Spin your fingers. Right, that's facing me. Test. There we go again. So it went through and go straight ahead. Yes, it did. Can't remember doing this before. Remember, you can aim zero any time. Okay, fair enough. So, well, what we got on here? Let's move it a little bit further forward. I don't know if you can see that it's blue at this moment in time. Um, so, all right, okay. Oh, oh, we're off. There we are, we're moving him around. I'll stop just there. Well, there we go. I've been able to move him around. I think I uh, want to have a little bit more of a play with him. But there we are, that's sort of the uh, the opening of Sphero. Um, I will do um, some more videos on this. That's when I get a little bit more experience on it. But it looks very good. I'll see if I can get the old uh, firmware update um, sorted as well um, when I can next come back. Um, I've got also I've got four cats that are going to be very very interested in playing around with this. So um, we'll see how we go, and um, I'll see you on the next video. Okay, hope you enjoyed this uh, unboxing. Thanks. See you next time.